Hello everyone, you are welcome to how to solve this very nice system of equations. Our job is to find the value of uh, x to the power 2026 plus uh, y to the power 2026 plus uh, z to the power 2026. First we calculate the value of xy plus yz plus zx by using this uh, algebraic identity x plus uh, y plus uh, z whole squared is equal to x squared plus uh, y squared plus uh, z squared plus uh, 2 times uh, xy plus uh, yz plus uh, zx. We replace this uh, x plus y plus z with this 1 and this uh, x squared plus y squared plus z squared with this 3. So this will become 1 squared is equal to 3 plus uh, 2 times uh, xy plus uh, yz plus uh, zx. This uh, 1 squared is 1 and move this 3 to the left hand side this will become 1 minus 3 is equal to 2 times uh, x times y plus uh, y times z plus uh, z times x. 1 minus 3 is negative 2 this is equal to 2 times uh, x y plus uh, y z plus uh, z x. If we divide both sides by 2 this implies that uh, x y plus uh, y z plus uh, z x is equal to negative 1. Now we calculate the value of uh, x y z. By using this algebraic identity x cubed plus uh, y cubed plus uh, z cubed minus 3xyz is equal to x plus y plus z times x squared plus y squared plus z squared minus x times y plus yz plus Z X. In this identity, we replace this uh, X Y plus Y Z plus Z X with this negative one. This is equal to negative one, and this uh, X squared plus Y squared plus Z squared, X plus Y plus Z, and uh, X cubed plus Y cubed plus Z cubed. X plus Y plus Z is equal to 1 and X squared plus Y squared plus Z squared is equal to 3 and uh, X cubed plus Y cubed plus Z cubed is equal to 10. This is equal to 1 and this is equal to 3 and this is equal to 10. So this will become 10 minus 3 times X Y Z is equal to 1 times 3 minus negative 1. Further simplify this will become 10 minus 3 times x y z is equal to 3 plus 1. And move this 10 to the right hand side this will become negative 3 x y z is equal to 4 minus 10 this will become 3 times x y z is equal to negative 6 if we divide both sides by negative 3 this implies that x times y times z is equal to 2 and we recall that uh, x times y plus uh, y times z plus uh, z times x is equal to negative 1 and uh, x plus y plus z is equal to 1. We recall that uh, x plus uh, y plus uh, z is equal to 1 and uh, x times y plus uh, y times z plus uh, z times x is equal to negative 1. So we suppose that uh, let x, y and z be the roots of a cubic equation. So this is the product of roots. Product of 
roots and this is the sum of roots and this uh, third one is the sum of products of roots two at a time so by using the vitas formula formation of a cubic equation is uh, t cubed minus sum of roots in this case is x plus y plus z times t squared plus sum of products of roots two at a time in this case x y plus y z plus z x times t minus product of roots in this case is x times y times z is equal to 0 so we replace this x plus y plus z with this 1 and this x times y plus y z plus z x with negative 1 and this with 2 so this will become t cubed minus t squared minus t minus 2 is equal to 0 we notice that uh, t is equal to 2 is a solution of this cubic equation which means that uh, t minus 1 is a factor of this uh, cubic equation so we can rewrite this uh, equation as uh, t cubed and we write this negative t squared as uh, negative 2 t squared plus uh, t squared we write this negative t as a negative 2 times t plus t minus 2 is equal to 0 from these two terms uh, we can factor out t squared in bracket left t minus 2 from these two terms uh, we can factor out plus t in bracket left t minus 2 from these two terms uh, we can factor out plus 1 in bracket left t minus 2 is equal to 0 and this uh, t minus 2 is a common factor so we factor out this uh, t minus 2 and uh, in bracket left uh, t squared plus uh, t plus uh, 1 is equal to 0 from here either this expression t minus 2 is equal to 0 or this expression t squared plus uh, t plus uh, 1 is equal to 0 From this equation we get the value of t is equal to 2 and from this uh, quadratic equation according to quadratic formula t is equal to negative 1 plus or minus square root of in place of b squared we write 1 squared minus 4 times a is 1 times c is 1 divided by 2 times a is 1 and t is equal to negative 1 plus or minus 1 squared is 1 and negative 4 times 1 times 1 is negative 4 1 minus 4 will become root negative 3 divided by 2 times 1 2 and this will become t is equal to negative 1 plus minus i times root 3 divided by 2 which means that uh, t is equal to negative 1 plus uh, i times uh, root 3 divided by 2 and uh, t is equal to negative 1 minus i times uh, root 3 divided by 2 and first we found that uh, t is 2 t is equal to 2 now recall that uh, recall that x y and z are the roots of a cubic equation recall that x y and z are the roots of a cubic equation so 
this first root 2 is equal to x x is equal to 2 and this second root is equal to y and this is a complex cube root of unity that is also called omega and this is equal to z this is also a complex cube root of uh, unity that is called omega squared now we have to calculate the value of uh, x to the power 2026 plus uh, y to the power 2026 plus uh, z to the power 2026 so this will be equal to 2 to the power 2026 plus uh, omega to the power 2026 plus uh, omega squared to the power 2026 next 2 to the power 2026 plus uh, omega to the power this uh, 2026 is same as uh, 3 times uh, 375 plus uh, 1 plus uh, this omega squared to the power 2026 will become omega to the power 2026 times 2 4052 next 2 to the power 2026 plus uh, omega to the power 3 times uh, 375 plus 1 plus uh, omega to the power this uh, 4052 is same as 3 times uh, 1350 plus uh, 2 next 2 to the power 2026 plus uh, this expression can be written as uh, omega cubed whole to the power 375 times uh, omega plus uh, this expression can be written as uh, omega cubed to the power 1350 times uh, omega squared now because uh, omega cubed is equal to 1 so this will become 2 to the power 2026 plus uh, this will become 1 to the power 375 is 1 times uh, omega plus uh, this will become 1 to the power 1350 is uh, 1 times uh, omega squared and this will become 2 to the power 2026 plus uh, omega plus uh, omega squared and because uh, omega plus uh, omega squared is equal to negative 1 so this will become 2 to the power 20 26 minus 1 so this is the required value of uh, x to the power 2026 plus uh, y to the power 2026 plus uh, z to the power 2026 this is the final answer of uh, this problem